Fallen is a song written by Alicia Keys. It's R and B and it's in uh twelve eight so there are twelve eighth notes or quavers in a bar. And the crotchet dotted, which accounts for three excuse me, um <clears throat> three quavers is uh in sixty four dotted crotchets beats per minute. So it starts off with this sing singing bit. And then it comes in with the piano for, so there's three bars, one bar there for nothing, and two bars equivalent for rests. And then it's one, two, you can count this, one and uh, two and uh, three and uh, four and, uh, I count it, one, two, three, four, five, six, two, two, three, four, five, six, one. Whatever works for you, there's no rights or wrongs, although somebody might argue with that. Um... So whenever you see a dot after a um, note, it increases its value by half. So that's a minimum, which is two crotchets worth, plus a half. So that's, or in other words, six quavers. One, two, three, four, five, six. And there's a six quavers. There's a crotchet dotted that equates for three quavers. And open, so there's a cross stick. Um, cross stick, they call it a rim click, but it's you'll see it in the demonstration. Um, it's where you have the stick lying down, part of it can be on the skin. Typically, it depends how you want to dampen the skin, and you just click it on the rim, and it's like a you, you create a hinge system, so it's an open on the sixth hi-hat of the second half of the bar and then closes on that so that's an open open cross for uh, close bass bass two three click the bass bass two three click the bass two three click bass 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 so read vertically whatever's on top you look from top to bottom that's what you do in that visual field so hat with a bass hat with a click hat with a bass 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 I mean, all of this, once you count in the sixes or the however you want to handle the 12 eights, yeah, it, it's all pretty easy. Um, more of the same, we've done that here, except after this point, we're on the skin of the drum, so the head of the drum. And then you've got the right symbols here, a big flam here, and it rests for basically the second half of the sixes. One, two, three, four, five. Six, two, two, two. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and then you go back to the way you kind of started here. Boom, two, two, click, two, bass, bass, two, two, click, two, bass. Continue similar. I added a few in between bass drums and open hats. I think it sounded okay. I I went around the toms. No, oh, that's just my computer. I went around the toms here, so but I kept the bass bass line here, and that's an improvisation that you can do on top so that just continue similar but I suppose purely speaking as long as it's got the bass drum there then you just continue similar you can repeat that or you can add different drums as long as it's in the style of that root bar that core bar one two three four five six left stick then right stick then that's they just want to see that so there'd be right, left, right, left, right, right. So there'd be right, left, right, left, le left, right, left, right, left, left. But it's up to you how you want to navigate that. I'm, I'm not going to tell you what's what. Into the right symbol, right, just like that. A crash symbol here, but with the right, right, ding, ding, snare, ding, bass, bass, right, right, crash there. Hold it for three crotch, uh, quavers, and then you do more of the same. Then one, two, three, snare, bass, bass, flam on snare, two, three, and then flam, bass, bass, crash. That's a flam on the floor. That's a bass, bass, that's a crash bass. That's a crotchet with a dot, a minimum with a dot, increase it by 50%, and... Yeah, thanks for thanks for watching. Hope you find it useful.